this is album real. is, uh, I'm super serial right now. This album is gonna be, probably go down in history as the worst attempt of making a metal record in the history of the universe. Yep. <laughs> your drums. Do you like the way they sound and stuff? Yeah. Uh, I think you played like garbage on them though. Yeah, right. This is the Havoc drum set that was used to record the new album. Oh, hey, look who it is. It's P. Weber. Oh, hey, dude. So, uh, P. Weber, tell me about your drum set. So, we got a Pearl Masters MCX Lime Green Sparkle Fade. Ooh. 10, 12, 16, 22 inch kicks. Omar Hakim Signature uh, Snare Drum. Snare Drum, Snare Drum, Snare Drum. <laughs> got the Aquarian Heads. Um, Aquarian Heads, huh? Yeah. Plug those guys. Look at that. Good stuff. Upside down aquarium. Uh, I got my DB drum shoes and my drummer's gloves. Um, I've been using Trick Pro V1 pedals. Uh, oh man, you got those tricks? Oh yeah. You got all them hoes and those tricks? Mm -hmm. Damn, fool. Realistically, I think it's gonna be fucking awesome. Realistically, the songs are, uh, the best as, as opposed to Burn, the first album, this new one, Time Is Up, is faster, heavier, more technical, and way more catchy. So it's pretty much better in every single way. How do you feel about your bass? I think it sounds like dead carcass and shit. Dead carcass shit. I think it sounds pretty cool. <laughs> that was pretty gnarly. It's gonna be sweet. And I think, uh, I think some bass players might appreciate it. Maybe. A little too early there, buddy. Fuck! Can't handle this shit. How do you feel about that? Tired of this shit. This sounds like the first Wham record mixed with the technicality fucking uh, of the Ramones. Blitzkrieg Bop. Yeah. You don't get any better than that. But, in all seriousness, uh, when this album comes out, if you're watching this, you need to buy it because it's probably going to kick you right in your dick sack.